Christmas, Matt. Merry Christmas, Al. Wow. So, uh, See you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's a Christmas spectacular. Christmas, with, watch out, everyone. With negative guests. <laughs> negative guests. Uh, no presents. No presents. No presents. Not really all that Christmas themed. No. There's a fan on. <laughs> That's true. You know that old Christmas song about a fan. <laughs> ring, ring, the wind. In my face. <laughs> ring, ring the wind. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. That's of, not a song. One of the greats. I wish it was. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, nobody else is here. <laughs> so, uh, so last week, I was visiting my friends. Right. And I figured, oh, I'll record with them while I'm visiting. Right. Didn't. Okay. So last week, there was um, just a video of me playing a game. Okay. Um, and now this week... Now this week we to we the, had to put something together to show the true meaning of Christmas. That's right. Um, I went out and I sold all my hair <laughs> to uh, buy you this wig. Matt is completely bald. That's right. And is it, there's some pubic hair in here as well? Uh, your words, not mine. Okay. But yes. All right. I'm beautiful. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. This You're is welcome. Great, um, I got you. These ruby slippers. Oh no! You're supposed to get me a comb. Ah, fuck. Right? You're See, supposed um, to. You're supposed to get me a comb, and then I sold my hair to get you a comb. And I sold my comb collection. I I don't know what I don't know what the other person in that story sold actually. See, I, I was raised in a family where we were taught songs like "Ring Ring," the fans <laughs> blowing on my face. So this right. Christmas story with the the hair and. It's foreign to you. Yes, it's oh. very foreign. Okay. Yeah, there's an old Christmas tale okay. of, uh, I think it's a man and a woman, who uh, basically one sells something to get the other a comb for their beautiful hair. And the other one. And the other one goes cuts, off all their, cuts off all their oh, hair. okay. Yeah, to, se- <laughs> to make a wig for the other person. Hmm. Uh, odd present. Yeah, <laughs> I shaved my head for a wig for you. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Love. Uh... <laughs> 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 Fuck. Uh, oh. oh man. But yeah, no one's here. Uh, Al, uh, no, Al's here. I'm here. Uh, Sight. <laughs> it... <laughs> Al's like, you look over, I'm gone. <laughs> oh god, how did I get in his house? <laughs> um, Sight is visiting his family in uh, wherever the fuck gay people come from. Gay orgy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> family. Every, every Christmas he's like, I gotta go visit my family. Family. And you see him leaving with like a duffel bag full of lube. Ugh, it's it's just, gross. It's disgusting. Um, Reggie is busy doing Christmas shit, mm-hmm. which I assume means killing, baking. <laughs> uh, baking and killing bad children? At the same time. Wow. She's really, she breaks into the home of everybody on the naughty list. <laughs> she bakes nice cookies for okay. everybody in the house, and okay. then she kills the child nice, who's being right. eaten. Yeah. She's Krampus, actually. Ooh. Yeah. That's another name for Reggie in wherever that comes <laughs> in from. German or yeah. something. And uh, Nikolai... Uh, he's he's the true spirit of modern day Christmas. That's true. Working. He's working. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> he's uh, working and uh, he nice. hates it. Beautiful. As he should. As he should. Yeah. But um, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to all. <laughs> and to all a good night. Um... So, me and Al said, no, 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 this won't stand. No. And we trudged here through... Snow. Snow and ice. Ugh. Semen. Sleet. Yetis. I don't even know why I was outside. Yeah, you we, lived I, here. I went to your house and then we came back. Yeah, it was really awkward. Yeah. I was like, well, I can drive. I was like, nope, we're walking <laughs> the whole time. So we're uh, real sweaty. Yeah. That's why the fan's on. Mm-hmm. And the window's open. Ring, ring, the fan's yeah. blowing in my face. <laughs> Um, so, uh, we do have some fan art. We do. Because we did get, uh, a few, uh, Christmas themed That's right. No, no, uh, no Twitter questions this okay. week. No I, Twitters. I said, you know what? This is a Christmas special. We do have Christmas themed fan art, so. Yes. So that's one thing, at least. Right. 
Um, and then we have a little special thing, and we may we may play some games. No, uh, no promises. No, no promises because I break them. And Al's Al's got to get out of here. I do. He's got to go. He's got to go see the Star Horse. Star Horse number Trace. Right. No. no. What? <laughs> Star Wars number f- seven. 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 Episode, Second time. Episode seven. Second time. Yes. Woo! Big spender. Ooh, boy. All right. Uh, this first one is actually from Trey. What's up, Trey? And uh, how you doing? Trey sent us some uh, little bro. Um, fan art. Little bro style. Little bro. Or fan know, art of little bro. Fan art. Oh, that little bro drew. Okay. And you'll see in a moment. Okay. I, I don't think you've been notified of this. I don't think I've notified any of you of this. I I have not been notified. But uh, I think you may have seen this. But either way, uh, boom. I have not seen that. So that's little bro's t-shirt. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Are you serious right now? Because you, yes. you haven't seen that design. Right? I have not seen that design. Yes. And I am in love with it. And uh, I can get you one for Christmas. You cannot. Like. Yes, I can. You cannot. I can. In a... in I mean, a not before in a, Christmas. In bear sizes? Be like, in bear sizes. I mean, oh I would imagine. God. I hope so. Okay, so I need to see it a little closer if you okay. could zoom in. Please. Let me actually, I could go to the uh, the OG design. Oh, we have an we OG can... design. So let's see. Um, a little bro. So there we go. So the, the right is my fallout and left is you guys. Right, okay. So uh, we'll start from the top. We got Reggie. Right. Reggie with her sweet ass sword. And then uh, I believe on the other side is supposed to be Janet. Janet, yes. Janet, yes. Okay, I got Janet, Janet right. Seich and Nikolai. Mm-hmm. Seich, no face. Of course. No face. Of course, no face. Uh, uh, and then on the uh, let, let me let me take a look at this uh, okay. or try on this. Yeah. That's Jerry McGoolberry mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and Ball Arms. There you go. Hundred wow. percent. You're gonna win this trivia. Nice. Now this one's a little hard. No, it's not. <laughs> That is your face. Yes. That is your beautiful face. And it is adorable. It is adorable. And that is Mr. Cuddlesworth? Mm-hmm. Wow, really? Yes. Wow, I got them all. Nice. Damn. And uh, then that's me and me. Right. That's that's Peace Me, and then that's me who shoots things. Mm-hmm. And we got Darlene, Harvey, and Steve, and Chumpkins. Right. It's an amazing design. I love. It. It's very Star Warsy. Yes, it is yes. very. That was a little projection thing. Nah, 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 and I nah, do. Nah. I do have to get uh, these t-shirts out to our uh, artists, uh, Little Bro, Tori, and Marina. Oh, no, yeah. Oh, there's, there's more. So. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So, uh, this is amazing. Thank you so much. This is fucking fantastic. Oh, I want it in my life. Get it for me now. <laughs> Order it right after. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you, little bro, and thank you, Trey. Yes, thank you, little bro, and Trey. So because uh, yeah. that is sick. So now when you now when you draw things, it can be in the background on the floor. That's right. Yes. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so uh, next up is uh, Siegel Smith. What's up, Siegel Smith? Now Siegel Smith, he he says in this email he loves you. This is just a joke. Okay. This is just a joke. He loves you. He says, hashtag, okay. Matt's the best bear. I have a feeling this is going to be mean. <laughs> it's not. It's like a medium. When you premise it it's with, a, a, I love you, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a medium love to uh, I'm okay with me. Okay. Uh, boom. The only photo. <laughs> <laughs> that's not mean. That's hilarious. And there you go. Yep. All in the background. <laughs> Oh, that's that is fantastic. <laughs> that is a still from our uh, video. Yes, uh, uh, episode from episode one hundred and fifty, I think. Yes, and I don't remember. It was like five, six episodes. <laughs> exactly. <ago. laughs> Who remembers that far back? No. But uh, oh my god, that's hilarious. You don't have to apologize for that, man. Come on. It's beautiful. Beautiful shot. That is a beautiful it's area. Like there's new hope on the right. Oh shit! They could find us through Google Maps. They could triangulate those trees with that pool. Oh my god! Uh, I gave away that it's a pool. Oh, what did uh. you do that for? <laughs> they couldn't tell that. That could have been anything. I'll, I'll dub in bakery. Okay. Yes. Perfect. Okay, good. Whew. So, well, uh, that was very funny, man. You don't have to be sorry about that. <laughs> Seagull Smith. Seagull Smith. You fucking asshole! You're dead to me. <laughs> dead. Dead. 
Um, That's going to be so loud, I apologize. It's all right. <laughs> um, this next one is from uh, Captain Smiles the Third. Captain Smiles the Third. Yes. Okay. And now I chose this one. Um, I was just thinking, none of these are really Christmas themed. Um, the last one is. Okay. But uh, Captain Smiles uh, sent this one, and, I, and we're looking at this one because this one has uh, you and I in it. Okay. It was fitting. Absolutely. Yes. Um, so Captain Smiles. Uh, boom. So that's Hobo Life Friends. When the podcast ends. <laughs> and apparently nice. it's ending now because uh, right. we're not in the corner yet. I am a little bit closer to you. Right. And uh, I think. I, I, is my brain exposed? Yeah, your head, you have like. I have a really hard hobo life. <laughs> if my brain is exposed. We both don't have legs. Mm -mm. I have a pirate. I kind of look like Obi Wan Kenobi with no legs. You are a little bit Obi Wan <laughs> Kenobi with a pirate. Home. And you're. Do you remember Rex from New Vegas, the dog with the yeah the brain? That's what you kind of look like. Except with no legs. Or a face. Or any <laughs> distinguishable <laughs> features. <laughs> Your one arm got bigger. Yeah. The other one got smaller. If something is wrong with my hands. <laughs> um, I, I, I guess I've grown cat ears, but also... Is that three, three of them? Three ears? I, I think know. you have three cat ears. I don't know what... Ca I, I guess radiation, maybe? Or is it a mohawk in the middle? It could be. Regardless, Hobo Life Friends... Is going to happen, and it's going to be fantastic. It's, yeah, I mean, don't expect Matt to talk much without a mouth. Right. So... <laughs> And I'll probably be drooling. Also, we don't own a microphone because we're hobos. <laughs> no, we're just in <laughs> an alley talking to each other. Well, you're talking. Well, you're waving, so you know. Oh, this is kind of creepy. You know, in some other dimension, where things are better, and we have an actual podcast that we're. <laughs> I'm waving into <laughs> through the oh, dimensions. Oh God! Don't. Now you're now you're talking a whole multiverse theory. It's Christmas, Al. I can't deal with this. Come well, on. Santa and another Claus. and another one. We're at Santa's shop, and all our friends are here. Um, it's yep. the best podcast ever. <laughs> yep, that would be. They those would be good friends. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Let's we could wave to that dimension. That's true. So we're waving. And ours is at least a little happier than Hobo Dimension. Mm -hmm. They get to see me with the... Uh, tw oh, no, I took down the twirls. The twirlies. I, 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 for everyone at home, I've grown a mustache. It's a moustache. Yes. Um, like, a fancy one. Uh, and it's gotten to the point where it's long enough that I can twirl the ends, Jeez. like uh, Snidely Whiplash Amazing. from Dudley Do-Right. Uh, I kind of I kind of want to take a picture of you and then me and then put us in ugly sweaters. <laughs> Just Photoshop in ugly yes, sweaters? That's yes. no fun. We'd have to wear the ugly sweaters. I don't have any. I, I, didn't bring I just any. have warm sweaters. Warm sweaters are the best. Yes. You it's, have the same type as me with the shit on the inside. Yeah. Keep it warm. And the, for, does it bother you that the, the inside of it is warm, but then like the sleeves, you see the sleeves are not... It stops. Well, see, that's where... Uh, I, I Separates the, the boys from the, the men. I, yeah, that's where I have the one up on you. See, this is fully coated in thermal all the way down, even to the arms. I'll never be cold again. I, yeah, I don't. I, someone skimped when they got me that. Fucking Mom. take it back. <laughs> <laughs> she listens. It's okay. Yeah. Uh, wow. <laughs> She's heard you say a lot of foul yeah. shit. <laughs> oh God. Um... So, Go on. Thank you, Captain Smiles. <laughs> <laughs> I won't leave it on. Um, thank you, Captain uh, Smiley the Third. The third. Captain Smiley the Third. To showing us how it could be worse. Right. Be thankful if we're not in a... a glimpse into the multiverse. Yes. Now, uh, this next one, I am going to show it next week just because it is fantastic and I love it. Okay. And it's from Marina. Marina? Marina? OG Marina. OG Marina. Yeah. I think she's earned OG status at this point. Yeah, no, she's OG status. So, Marina. Um, Marina drew this one, and then she also drew another fantastic one of Seich with some ladies, which I will show next week. Hopefully, Seich isn't dead um, from all that fucking... Right. Um, so... Getting skewered from both <laughs> ends. Um, this is an RLF Christmas by Marina. Oh my god. Oh my god. Marina, what? Why are you wasting your time 
on us. <laughs> Can I take a picture of this and send it to them now? If you want. <laughs> I do. Okay, go ahead. I, oh, oh, oh. All right, this can't stay here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's going to be about, a, a wet bed Christmas. <laughs> that was about to become your bed. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna have to take a picture of this now and send it yeah. to them because that Anyone? is amazing. Say, this is what you fuckers have missed. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> hey, here's some, uh, by the way, for you folks at home, here's some dead air. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and take a picture with my new phone. Ooh. Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, we fellas. We are sponsored by the Galaxy 6 That's Edge. That's true. Get your edge on. Get your edge on. Yeah. Flash ruined it without <laughs> flash, though. My God. Marina. Look at that picture quality, though. That is beautiful. Samsung Galaxy L uh, 6 L uh, Edge Plus. Santa Claus. He'll be coming down that chimney with some, some of those babes. I don't think... Don't guarantee them that. Ask your parents for Santa Claus. Get you some sweet Galaxy. What is it called, sir? Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. Samsung Galaxy <laughs> 6 Edge. S6 Edge Plus. There's too much. <laughs> this, is this podcast going to be named that? <laughs> Galaxy Samsung. No, Samsung Galaxy. Samsung Galaxy. Samsung Galaxy. S6. S6. Edge Plus. Edge Plus. Yes. So is Edge... Is there just a regular edge, or is the edge plus? A uh, I edge? believe there is a regular edge. Mm -hmm. But this has the edge where you can uh, edge it more. Right, exactly. Now you get what I'm saying. Nice. It has the vibration feature. Do you like treadmill bit? Uh, I don't think so. Yeah. I don't think that's in the next one. I think that's in the next the one. Larger the larger phone? Yeah. Okay. The S6 Edge Mighty. That, Samsung Galaxy S7 <laughs> Mighty. Right. Edge. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, All right. Marina, I'm speechless. This is amazing, Marina. That's fucking... That's for me. <laughs> oh, God. I, I just love that we're... I love all of our faces. I love... Everyone is perfect. <laughs> Like, me and Nikolai both realized that his balls were on my head at the same time. <laughs> Seich does not care. And, okay, I guess it makes sense that I'm on the top because I'm the, the lightest yeah. and the shortest. So yeah, but it's also very difficult for you. Thanks for helping. Well, I guess, no, Reggie couldn't be really. Yeah, up. Reggie, I mean, who she... She couldn't be on top of anyone. Yeah. Also, thanks for helping, Seich. We need someone to make sure that if we fall down, you know. Yeah. Someone. She kills us quickly <laughs> and puts us out of our misery. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I sent I I, I I I'm so happy with this. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much, Marina. You have made my day. Thank you for contacting me. She contacted me like a while back. Like hey, really? uh I know you're probably gonna not see this for eight months, so That uh, see she and she, she does. knows us she so does. well. Marina, you 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 win this week. You I'll win. Think. You you're win. The, you're the first. Congratulations. And our winner. <laughs> <laughs> you Tell win. her what she's won, Al. Well, Marina, you won an, uh, a fan art t-shirt, which I will send to you. Not because you made two of the designs. Right. But because you're the winner of our left fan art this week. That's right. Congratulations. Congratulations. Merry Christmas. It's on your way. I already got your address. Just kidding. I need it from you. <laughs> Same to you, little bro and Tori. But I will yes. send you an email. Little bro sent me an email. Did he? What did he say? Thanks. And he has a big project. And then I didn't respond. Because I'm me. So, little bro. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm me. And so, little bro, I will try. Hopefully, I respond. Before this That's... is out, tomorrow is Wednesday, so hopefully. I mean. If not, low bro, I did read your email, and I'm up for anything. 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 I, I got the bucket of oil ready. Uh, Alyssa said, OMG. That is literally the coolest. <laughs> she said, totally great. Oh. T t t totally great. T totally great. Do, 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 do. And we just break it down into a... Do, do yeah. you have it? <laughs> so that's all the Christmas theme we need. That's all the Christmas. Thanks for listening, everyone. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Yeah. 
And if I need a gun, I ho, ho, ho. Ho, bro, <laughs> Ho, bro, Ho, bro, 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 See, we didn't finish the full saying, so we don't no, have to turn off the Exactly. Topic. See how that's we get you. Mm-hmm. Actually, I think um, <laughs> uh, the last episode we did do... We said it, and we didn't turn it off. <laughs> we did, but I replaced... Um, I don't know if Nikolai caught it, but I replaced the ending with you guys coughing. Oh, I, really? No, Nikolai. Nikolai coughed a lot, but that was because he was sick. Right. But I added uh, a lot of co- extra coughing in that episode just because I was bored. <laughs> just because I was so bored. So the ending, it's if I don't want to be, if I need a gun, I don't want to, and then just like a, a, a chorus of coughing. <laughs> a chorus of coughing? <laughs> just, um... So yes, I uh, I completely forgot about that. I I guess Nikolai will go over those comments because there's got to be some good ones, if he ever if you know gets that job done. If if it's a big if. Now um, we are going to be doing something a little bit special. That's right. Uh, this is very cool, and I just learned about this today mm-hmm. from Al. Now this is a um, this is stolen directly from a podcast called a Blastro Podcast. I'll have a link to it. Kia. Um, they do a lot of science podcast stuff and uh, things like that, but occasionally do, they do something called um, Muffed Movies. Yes. Where they basically uh, improv an entire movie. Mm-hmm. Um, they don't watch it, they just go off of notes. Right. And I'm not completely plot sure. Points? Yeah, plot points. I'm not completely sure how they do it because they, they do go over most of the points pretty well. Um, and I don't know how they, I guess, because I, I went on Wikipedia to get these plot points and such. Right. Um, but basically, like I said, they improv a whole movie. Mm-hmm. Um, and they do that every once in a while. And I, I, I just love the idea. So Link will be here to check them out. Uh, listen to their stuff. It's fantastic. Yes, please check them out. Check them out since we are stealing. Well, blatantly. <laughs> We're not going to call it Muff Movies, though. No. We'll call it something else. Uh uh, fucked up flicks. Fucked up flicks. Ah, <laughs> so, uh, ooh, a repackaging, if you will. <laughs> there we go. Uh, so check out Blaster Podcast. Um, and uh, last week also I was on my friend Tim's podcast. You can check that out while we're plugging shit. Matt, yes. were you on any podcast recently? No, I wasn't. Uh, well, no. No. Okay. Uh, oh, except for that one. Um, which one? It's uh, you might have heard of it. It's called The Critical Miss. Ooh. And it's uh, it's a D and D podcast. Um, and you, you, it's just the audio right now. Uh, yes, we're only doing the audio version uh, because video editing is a pain in the ass. A pain in the ass. Now I know you're just telling me this now, but um, you have a note with you. You says you you brought a clip. I. I did bring a clip. You did. I did bring a clip. Whenever you bring this uh, this podcast up, you always bring a clip, which is awesome. I, I right. love it. Um, and it's it's between me. Okay. And uh, and actually another member of the uh, the group. Vodka. Okay. Yeah. Um, and uh, I'm not going to reveal his identity. Okay. Uh, because I, I want to you know keep it confidential, but yes. uh, he actually came out to me as a, a serial killer. Wow. Yeah, and he discussed all the horrible things he does with the body. Okay. So here's here's the clip. And this isn't in character. This is No, this was a serious murders. moment. Yeah, we were talking about D and D and whatever okay, okay, and he, okay. he just kinda of broke it down a little bit. We were dissecting, you know, what our characters do and he and broke he... into this really weird place where, you know, he said all these horrible things he did with the uh, human body. That's pretty bad. Yeah. So uh, let's go to the tape. Yeah. Roll to seven. Oh, uh, well, that means, uh, well, uh, seven, you're not, you're not going to succeed your check then, you know? It'll be different in real life. How so? Oh, I, uh, you know, seven's snake eyes. That's not, no. It's well, not I- the way I do it. I wear a mask. I'm sorry? That's, My, uh, those are separate. Snake eyes is when you roll two ones on a set of dice. Oh, you're talking about the game world. Yeah, what are you talking about with a mask? The real world. You wear a mask to do what? Uh, can, I, can I be completely honest with you, Matt? Yeah. Have you ever uh, taken a life? No. No. Gets the blood pumping. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So, uh... Snake eyes. 
Is that what you call yourself? Yes. Your your snake eyes, the, I, the, the serial killer? Mm-hmm. I wrap around my victims and bite them. Oh, my God. Like this cookie? Just like that. You'd be wow. surprised how brittle bones are. Kind of like that cookie. Probably just as delicious. I don't know about that. Because bone is bone. And this is a cookie. Snake eyes. I'm going to leave now. All right. Uh, did you order the pizza? I did. All right. Three minutes or less, right? I, that's really not Domino's policy. <sighs> you know, I heard a lot of their drivers got killed because they were trying to get under that. Okay, I'm leaving now. Okay. <laughs> I mean, are you coming back? No. Okay. I, I mean, I guess I have enough for the pizza. I mean. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay, bye. So was that? So the that's end? it. Yeah. Was I'm, that the end of the podcast? That's or? the end uh, for now okay. until we get rid of that guy. Ooh, cliffhanger. Yeah. I like it. Snake Eyes is crazy. That's fucking shit. Check it out. Yeah. Critical miss. I'll put a uh, link here. Right. Right in here. Right there. At the bottom. Mm-hmm. And then. Nope. It's the top now. All, uh-huh. Oh, got you. I'm just fucking. <laughs> Don't worry, at least you didn't say someone's first and last name right. a hundred times. <laughs> Damn it, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Alright, so, um, fucked up flicks. Fucked up flicks! Um, today we were doing a Christmas story, not a Christmas story. Um, <laughs> not the hopes. movie, a Christmas story. No. An actual story about, about Christmas. Christmas. Uh, we're doing Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Mm. The 60s claymation maybe 70s i don't know Something. uh no i think it's older than it's older than 70s 60s the, or 50s because it's ranking and best so it was real old uh rudolph the red-nosed reindeer let's ask the internet brain is rankin and bass the company that made it what is rankin and bass that, i think i think cool? they were the company that made okay. it okay uh, I might be wrong about that. I thought that. you were saying they're ranking in a lot of bass. No. Like that's, that was code for money in the 60s. No. Ranking in the bass. I'm sure they say that somewhere in Mad Men. Oh, no, you were right. 1964. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Huh. Well, guess I'm hmm. gonna have to leave. Yeah. Hmm. Fuck you, Al. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> All right? All right. Jerk. So, um... I, 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 yep. I, Rankin and Bass. Rankin and Bass. They were producers. Oh, okay. And that's the company name? I... I'm, I'm just on Rankin I and Bass. I think it's, it's kind of, it's kind of like, uh... Uh... Like, what, what, like... Uh, the brothers who made The Matrix. Uh, yeah, but they're, they're directors. These okay. guys are producers. producers. Yeah. They know how to get shit done yes. in movies. All right. So, uh, we're doing Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. We have... <laughs> About 50 minutes to get through this. We've got six scenes. Okay. And uh, we'll just play through these. Um, obviously, this is the first time we're doing this, so it's probably going to be a little bit rough. I'll try to cut any rough spots, Matt, so no worries if we're discussing. What do you mean? I'm going to be fabulous. All right, perfect. Um, so, uh, yeah, I guess we'll just dive in. Um, I'll, I'll narrate, I guess, these scenes, and you can jump in and take whatever character you want. Okay. And then we'll go from there. Um, all right. The North Pole. Snow falls on the icy kingdom of Santa Claus. A reindeer is born under a shooting star. I don't know what baby reindeer sound like. <laughs> oh, he's beautiful. My first baby boy. I'll name you... The mother looks around the room. She sees a picture of a kangaroo. Roo! She looks around and sees a picture of Adolf Hitler. Dolph! Rudolph! <laughs> the North Pole rings true as cold majesty flies by. Seven years later, Rudolph is at the reindeer games with his father, Donner. Hey, Dad! Now, Rudolph... I know your mother and I have let you run around with that yep. nose, nose exp- Okay, Rudolph. Yep. We've, my, your mother and I, we've let you run around the house with that nose exposed, but- Uh-huh. Okay, Rudolph. Yeah. 
Okay. We're gonna have to cover your nose. I'm gonna be late for the reindeer game. I'm good. All right, Rudolph, we're covering your nose up. Don't no. Pe- there are people in this world. I'm proud of my nose. Okay. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, you're gonna get some pretty racist remarks. I'm just. No, I'm not. These are reindeer. They're okay. members of Santa's kingdom. They would never ever hurt me. Okay, Rudolph. I didn't want to tell you this. Your uh, grandfather was uh, hung. What? He was, uh, he had a green nose, and they killed him. I don't believe you, Dad. Well, I'm going to go try out for the reindeer All right, well, I'm, I'm going to put this uh, dirt on your nose. No! All right. No! Rudolph's father slams some dirt on Ow. Rudolph's nose. Ow! Uh, get along, son. Uh, Donner mm. slaps Rudolph's ass in the direction of the boys. That's weird. I'm your son. Whatever. It's the 50s. <laughs> 60s, technically. Uh, Rudolph enters the reindeer games, coached by Comet. To see which reindeer are eligible to fly Santa's sleigh in the future, he meets a friend named Fireball. Alright, so I just put on this harness here, and then I just, I just fly? Yes, son. You gotta... Uh, Up in the sky? Yeah, you gotta... With you, Santa! Okay, yeah, you gotta jump in the sky. Uh-huh. Okay, now you, let me see your form. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Wow. All right. Is that? Did you? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Kid, you're shitting all over. Yeah. You're shitting. I'm sorry. I'm trying to generate enough force. Okay. Apparently, when you generate force, your just anus is spewing uh-huh. a little bit too much. Don't worry. It's your first tryout. It's it's fine, son. Mm-hmm. Uh. All right. Who's this? Who's the second runner-up? Uh, uh. Fireball. Hey. What's your name? Hi, I'm Rudolph. What's up, bro? Hi. You want smoke? Um, no. My Fire- dad says I can't. Cool, man. Fireball takes out a joint and lights it. Here you go, man. Hit this. I don't. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't want to. Fireball shoves the <laughs> joint into Rudolph's mouth. <coughs> That tasted like, like my dad's room. Yeah, bet it does. Mm. So, uh, whoa, that, that stuff will make you fly, buddy. Whoa. Yeah, why don't you get on this magic carpet? Whoa, man. Rudolph and Fireball get into stance. They jump together, as every other reindeer looks on in astonishment. My God, those those two boys are amazing. I'm doing it! Alright, one kind of shit a little bit. I'm flying! Alright, their, their stance is fantastic, though. <laughs> Wonderful. The two boys get on the ground as the reindeer cheer for them. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we did it! Thanks, Fireball. I never knew this, but drugs are amazing! No problem, man. Uh, Fireball jumps up and hoof slaps Rudolph, causing the dirt to fall off his nose. Oh! Oh! Your dirty red nose! Oh, I, I mean, my dad made me cover it up, but is it really such a big deal? Fire fucker! What? Yeah! Oh, that's a terrible thing to say to a seven-year-old. Rojo Viejo! Oh, uh, I get, I don't know, red? We're gonna use your... Red old? Yeah, red old. <laughs> old red. Devil fucker. I don't know if Viejo's old, but I'm, I think it is. It is, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are saying a lot of really mean and hurtful things right now. You're really you're different from us. I mean, yeah, I guess technically. Hey man, we don't need these fuckers. Let's get out of here. You're right. You're right. You're all a bunch of of dicks. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> we slowly zoom in to Santa's elf shop. An army of elves work tirelessly in a listless abandoned workshop. Managerial staff whip and scream at the elves. Hermie, one of the elves, is painting a small birdhouse. A perfect... Do, 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 just paint my birdhouse. Do, 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 paint a bird. Do, 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 paint a birdhouse. Hope I don't get whipped. Hermie! (laughs) Ah, shit. This this is the red line. You're clearly painting these blue. Ah, shit. I'm colorblind. Ah, 
Get out to get the whip out. No, it's come ma- on. Managerial. No, look, just tell me which one of these are red, and I'll, uh, I'll just switch it. Y- you're an elf, all right? Yeah. Your clothes are green and red. I'm not supposed to be telling you this shit. You know, I you tell me... What color clothes am I wearing right now? Red and green. My God. You got it. I mean, you sh- they're backwards, though. My God. Yeah. Look, okay. I'm sorry about this. Yeah, okay, listen. I can't let you go. I don't get you a whipping. Guess what? The big man whips me, and he... You know, he does it in a suit. Not I, a business suit. I don't... I don't understand. I, yeah, I, you know. I, I, I don't think you've seen it. We don't make the leather suits here. That's in the other department. Aren't we supposed to be spreading joy? Yeah. You know. Aren't we supposed to be spreading happiness? Yes. So what's with all the whipping? I mean, that's how we keep everyone in line. I mean, <sighs> when, when children get the toys, they, they, their parents don't say... By the way, and uh, Elf was whipped for this. Screw this! What? Screw this! Screw this! Really? Tony! What? I quit. Oh, you quit? I quit. Okay, what What are you gonna do? I'm gonna be a dentist. Oh, a fucking dentist. I wanted to be a, My father was a dentist. Okay, yeah, father was a dentist. My father was a dentist. Yeah, your father's dead. Yeah. He was And he hung. lived a good life. Yeah, until he was hung. Yeah, that part was not so good. Defending red-nosed reindeer. What's wrong with red-nosed reindeer? They Look, came here on the, over on the boats just like us. Yeah, the red boat. I don't like that shit. I will whip you right now. No, you won't, because I quit. Oh, god damn it. I'll get over here. Nope. Tony slowly lumbers over <laughs> to the dentist as he scurries away. Ah, getting too old for this shit. Uh, uh, the guy from Lethal Weapon drives by. Hey! From Lethal Weapon? <laughs> Mel Gibson? <laughs> Danny Glover? Danny Glover. <laughs> oh, because of I'm not too old for this shit. Oh my god, I didn't get why. I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Okay, I'm back with it now. I'm on it. I'm on the same page. Okay. All right, um, how are we doing Rudolph and Herb? Because you're, you're both of them. I mean, your Hermie was pretty much my, <laughs> your elf was pretty much my elf. All right, okay, uh, you, yeah, you you'll it. you'll you'll take over the character Herbie, of Hermie. Okay. Um, uh, Hermie runs out of the whipping mines, uh, clothes still intact, without whips on his back. Ooh, another rhyme. Rudolph, uh, crying. Uh, and <laughs> running, running away from fireballs, the two collide into each Ow. other. Sorry about that. You're not gonna whip me, are you? I... No? Why does... What? Everything seems really weird in the North Pole. Yeah, well, uh... It's pretty strict here. You yeah. You get crazy when they're cooped up. Yeah, they said I, I was a devil fucker because of my red nose. Oh my god. That's beautiful. I mean, not that you're a devil fucker. That you got a red nose. You think it's beautiful? Yeah. I mean, not like in a platonic way. Don't worry. Not, Sorry. not in a platonic way? No, in a platonic way. Look, I... Uh, are you hitting on me, you, mister? No, 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 kid. Look, I'm so... How old are you? Seven. Okay, I'm seventeen. Still weird. Yeah, no, don't worry. I'm not hitting on you, kid. Oh, yeah. okay. Uh, look, I'm an elf. They whip me. It's horrible. I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm guessing where you're from. Not that great. Yeah, no, it's pretty not great. All right. So, you, I mean, I'm go- I want to become a, d- a dentist. You okay with that? That's kind of my thing. Yeah, well, whatever, man. Fix teeth. I don't give a shit. All right. You're pretty, <laughs> you're pretty uh, loose kid. I like that. I'm, I mean, like, loose in a platonic way. I mean, I just got told to fuck off from my entire race because the color of my nose is different. So, yeah, like, who am I to judge, exactly. really? I mean, later we could get some. <laughs> I don't know. We could come back here. I mean, I'm not suggesting, you know... Have you ever killed a man? No. All right, what? No, just uh, forget I brought it up. Have let's, you? No. Oh, okay. I've only been whipped. Regardless, let's let's get out of here. Elves are weird. <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> the two walk among the tundra. There is nothing but darkness and hail. Eventually, they reach Yukon Cornelius, a prospector whose one desire is to find silver and gold. Who wants to be Yukon? Uh, Oh, hello there! Uh, hey, look, we were, uh, 
We're just going on our way. We yeah, don't want we, any trouble. Yeah, we don't want any trouble. We Look, we don't have any uh, weapons on us or anything. Well, I don't want no weapons. I'm just looking for silver and gold in them thar hills. Oh, them hills over there? Yeah, well, those hills right over there. Hey, listen, buddy. Uh, we're just trying to get away from Santa's devil shop. You... Santa? He doesn't exist. You're right. We're trying to find uh, a, a place to live. Uh, you mind if we... Uh... I don't know. Could, could, could we work for you? We're kind of hungry. You hungry, kid? I mean, yeah, I could eat. I, my parents don't really feed me that much. Okay, Jesus. My dad said food was for normies. Okay, wow. Uh, what did you eat? Um, mainly, like, stuff off the ground. Like snow? It's mainly snow. Yeah, a lot of snow. Wait, did you eat poop? No. Okay. Not often. All right, great. Don't <laughs> lick me, kid. Well, well, this is really weird to hear. But, uh, I could give y'all a job. Alright, that, that sounds wonderful. Um, ah, shit. You know what, I, I got a strong back, kid. I'm sure we could get any gold, I'll put it on your back, and, uh, I think that works. Does that sound good to you, Yukon? Well, what's your name? Well, I'm Yukon Cornelius. I'm a little bit, uh, psychic. Just want to say that much. Oh, no, I understand. Yukon, my man. <laughs> I will say this, though. My line of work isn't the safest. Uh, there's all sorts of dangers in them uh, hills. You're not gonna... like like sand traps and and other types of traps and of course abominable snow monsters. Abominable snow monsters. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, I haven't seen one in over fifty years, so the chances are almost impossible to. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> Rudolph's uh, uh, light nose blows blows red, very red. And uh, the abominable snowman, snowmaster, explodes out of the mountain. Uh, holy fucking shit! All right, this is uh, a little bit too much for me. Uh, I think we should uh, go hide. You know what? Any good place to get out of here? Well, I mean, I guess we could go to the iceberg. Wow. That one right over there? Yeah, I mean, you know. Good eye, kid. Quick, let's run. Get the fuck out of the way! <laughs> the three run to the iceberg and and uh, uh, try to break it off of the uh, connecting snow as the abominable snowman runs, runs toward them. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, we gotta break this. Quick, he's coming. Quick, use your feet to kick it. My Ooh. feet? Ooh. Uh, uh. Uh, don't you that got... doesn't seem to be working. You have any tools there? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I got my pickaxe. Use your goddamn pickaxe. What God. do you mean? Hit the fucking snow with the pickaxe. Oh, why did I not think of that? Jesus Christ. <coughs> As he picks at it, Rudolph slowly nibbles at the snow. Mm. This is sure is some good snow. God damn it, kid. Come on. What? It's finally, the snow breaks as the abominable snowman almost gets to them. <laughs> oh, that sure was close. Oh, 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 I pooped. Man, I, you know, whippings are looking good right now. <laughs> oh, you're telling me? Wait, what? <laughs> Slowly, throughout the night, the iceberg drifts. Rudolph's nose guides them. Soon, they land on an island, an island filled with misfit toys. The trio wakes up to find an assortment of horrifying mutilated toys surrounding them. Oh. Oh, sweet. Guys, wake up. Wake up. What's going on? Hello. Oh. Hi, oh. Mr. Meatball. A doll made completely out of meatballs. That is both horrifying and actually I haven't eaten in a long time, so kind of appetizing. Yeah, we're, we're probably going to want to eat you first. Not if I have anything to say about it. I'm Blade Boy. A doll made specifically out of blades. Wow, these toys are specifically only made out of one thing. Yeah, it's... Uh, kind of weird. <laughs> I, I, broke into, I broke into my Hermes. <laughs> oh, hey, look, it's, it's some guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these, these toys seem pretty dangerous. And I'm Anthrax Slinky. All right, that one different. That one's purely bad. Yeah, don't touch any of us. And the others, I guess, could be construed as toys. That one's just dangerous. I go down the slayers and tell everyone's 
die on the stairs as well. You mean like that? Yeah. Oh, shit. And I'm Whippy. The Whip. <laughs> All right. This... This is... I can... Well, there's too many toys on this island. I, I kind of understand why I was fired now, because this could happen. Like, first thing, you're painting the wrong colors next time you're getting whipped by Anthrax Slinky. Ugh. Wait. Wait. What? Hermie. Mm-hmm. Wait, that's not me. Sorry. Sorry, kid. No, you're Hermie. Oh, right. Never mind. Sorry, kid. Let's <laughs> <laughs> sleep. Hermie, listen. I... I know it seems kind of weird here, yeah. but but we can't have anywhere to go back to. Maybe we should just try and stay and make it work with these people. Not the anthrax one, but no. the others. The others don't seem like too bad. I mean, I mean, before I said I had no weapons, but I I, I got a revolver with four shots. I was gonna, you know, if we didn't find any food, I was gonna suggest maybe, you know, we off ourselves. My God, that's a horrifying notion. All right, so you're not on board with that. All right. No, thank you. Okay, all right. Uh, um, all right, I mean, what, what about you? Miss, oh. I, I got nowhere to go anymore. All that right. that mo abominable snow monster destroyed my cart and my entire operation is kaplooey. Abominable snow person? Yeah, uh, anthrax slinky. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, chill out. Yeah, we saw an abominable snow monster, all right? Whoa! The toys recoil and scream. All right. Listen, Mr. Anthrax Slinky. Yeah? Can we please talk to somebody about staying on the island? You want to talk to King Moonracer? That's an awful name. <laughs> well, that's who you got to talk to. All right. Well, where where do we go and meet Mr. Moon King Moon Racer? At the top of Rusted Nail Mountain. That is a horribly named mountain. Well, that's because that's what it's made of. Okay. Away. The um, slinky slinks away. Dead children pile behind it. <laughs> Rankin and Bass really took a dark turn. Um. I guess they go to, uh, uh, yeah. Let's, let's go see King Moonraiser. Several hours later, and a few tetanus shots as well, they reach the top of King Rusted Nail Mountain. King Moonraiser sits at, in his icy throne. Uh, who wants to be Moonraiser? I am King Moonraiser. Wow. How are you? Uh, uh, we're good. Uh, your majesty. Uh, me and my friends here. Hello. We seek. Hello there. We seek. Uh, uh, what's what's the word we're looking here for? Uh, solace. Uh, uh, asylum. Asylum. There we. Thank you, Yukon. Look at you. Loving it. You wish to seek asylum on the island of King Moonracer? Yes. And the island of Misfit Toys. Yes, and we uh, we fit right in here. We're we're all a little bit broken. Uh, I, for instance, uh, well, I want to do dentistry, and I'm an elf. Mm. I uh, also have a slight bent penis. That information is irrelevant. I just wanted to a little bit overboard, but hey, I mean, you got a meat. I do you gotta, have yeah? a molar that needs fixing. Okay, right. I uh, sorry. I thought. You were going to use... Dentist, the, right? Yeah, I thought you were using the other, the bent penis one. No. Okay, all right. Sorry about that. Let's get over the bent penis okay, thing. Okay, I'm, I'm real sorry. I mean, it's a big issue for me. Not for me. I mean, it's like a, a 90 degree angle. Hmm. It's real. It's bad. I mean, I got... Okay, uh, sorry. Uh, kid, you, you're up next. What's wrong with you? Well, I guess I got a red nose, so... You know, because of something I was born with, I don't belong. Yeah, right. He's kind of got a weak argument. And uh, Yukon, what about you? Uh, bent, bent something? Well, I'm a prospector, prospecting for silver and gold in mountains covered in six feet of snow. All right, so mental problems. Severe. All right. Beautiful. Mm, if that abominable snow monster hadn't come along, I'd have eaten you both. Wow. Okay. I mean, 
Thank God you didn't. I have a... Uh... I'm still considering it. All right, well, okay. So, <laughs> King Moonracer, will you accept us? Hmm. I must ponder this. Oh, fuck. Yes. Oh, wow, okay. On one condition. Ah, oh, shit. I have cared for these misfit toys for a long, long time. All right. I wish you mm -hmm. to make a pact with Santa that he will deliver these misfit toys to children across the world who will love them. And in return, you may stay on the island. <sighs> I, I, I can't go back there. They'll kill me. First, they got snipers on the top of that, that place. Yukon. They don't know you. But Rudolph. Look, it, it seems like just the reindeer kind of don't like you. So, uh, I don't know. Could well, you... I mean, you know, most of the time when I go past, the elves all just kind of spit on me, but... All right, I, uh... I think you've spit on me a couple times. Oh, uh, oh wait, you were that reindeer? Yeah. Uh, well, look, hey, peer pressure. All right, kid? Oh, I try can not, understand that. Try not to stick out. You know what I mean? Literally, with your nose. But, look. With the abominable snow monster coming after me and my red nose. Uh. And. Wait, he's, he's still coming? I mean. Not in front of the moon racer king. Wait, he, he might. <laughs> <laughs> the sound of the abominable snowman. Uh, or snow monster. Reaches them. They look below and see. The snowman ripping apart anthrax slinky. Oh no! Now I'm double the deadly. Oh, I knew this would happen! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Everywhere I go, bad things happen to people. I should just go back and let them hang me. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit! Look, kid. Look. You just get back to Santa, you get the word out that he wants Moonfucker, whatever his name is, wants these toys spread across the... Alright, maybe not the Anthrax one, but still, uh, just get the word I out. I also think Playboy is kind of unacceptable. Uh, I mean, uh, 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 parents who teach their children about blades, maybe. I don't know. That's true. It's a little lenient on my It's part. a stretch, but I'll take yeah, it. Yeah, it's a little stretch. Uh, but listen... I and Yukon, you staying here, what are you doing? Oh, I'll stick with you folks. Okay, good. Yeah. Look, L Rudolph, I'm... Okay, you okay there, Ru Yukon? Oh, yeah, just, you know. Look, I have your... Hungry. Bent penis. Just saying. Mm, probably tender. All right, no, it's... All right, well, Rudolph, you go, get back... We will fight off the abominable snowman. Hopefully he stays here and doesn't immediately follow you because you have a red nose and that's what he's being attracted by and such. Right. Does that sound okay. good, moon, moon Racer? It sounds good to me. All right. Beautiful. Rudolph slowly descends the rusted mountain. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Ow! Who made your mountain out of nails? <laughs> Um, Rudolph, for years, <laughs> he got lost. For years, <laughs> he just wandered around the North Pole eating snow. Gets the abominable snowman chasing him. In the midst of running, he loses his way, and for years, he tries to survive off the land whilst evading the abominable sm snowman. Oh boy, I'm sure in for a lot of snow. Eventually, five years later. He comes upon his family, held captive by the abominable snowman. Rudolph knows that this may be a trap, but he's got to save his family. Mm. So, I guess I gotta try and save them. I mean, kind of seems like karma to me. Rudolph, but... son, is that you? No. Rudolph realizes his nose is glowing unbelievably uh, bright. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Son, please help us. Oh, son, wait. Why did you run away? Oh, uh, well, you kind of hated me. I don't know. We didn't hate you. You never really, like, fed me or loved me. Okay, well, we didn't call you a devil fucker. 
Okay, yeah, that's, I guess, yeah. you showed me that, There's courtesy. There's levels of care. Mm. Sorry. Can you save us, please? <laughs> Look, I'll do something. <laughs> I could just say, time out from the bit real quick. I love the fact that Rudolph's mom is a German accent away from being <laughs> roommate at <Hitler. laughs> <coughs> Oh, uh. Oh, my God. Uh, all right. Uh, <laughs> shit. No. Uh, she's right. They cared for me. They made sure I had plenty of snow to eat. And they never called me devil fucker. I'm gonna help the. I'm gonna help them out. I'm gonna redeem myself. I'm gonna save my family. Here I come, abominable snow monster. Take this! Oh. Oh. The abominable Ow. snowman hits uh, Rudolph directly in the face. He oh. Immediately oh, falls. God. He immediately falls unconscious, oh. bleeding on the snow. Oh shit! <laughs> Fuck! His nose is blending in with all the blood. Holy shit. Oh, God. Don't, don't look, honey. Don't look. <clears throat> the abominable snowman goes to devour their son when suddenly... Hey, you get away from my friend. Uh, hold it right there, abominable snow monster. <clears throat> the abominable snow monster turns around to face these two new threats. We're going to take you down to Pound Town. That's right. And when I'm done, I'm gonna fuck you in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> little, little hard. I thought you were gonna. You took everything from me. Okay, all right. Calm down. <laughs> Yukon runs head first into the abominable snowman with a pickaxe. <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, Yukon begins to stab the abominable snowman. His skull deteriorates as it's crushed with each blow. <laughs> Take this, you. Filth, this snow monster. Oh. Go back to where you came from. Holy Tell shit. Tell him all that you can't Holy tell me. shit. The abominable <laughs> snowman's skull collapses as Yukon continues to hit the lifeless body <laughs> as blood drains from it. You must be Rudolph's parents. Uh, yes, thank you for saving us. Instead of our fire devil fucking son. Whoa, hey. Hey. Rudolph begins to wake up. <laughs> I may have edited the story. <laughs> son! Son, you're up! His parents run over to him. Lift him up. I... I I did it! I did it! I saved you guys! You did it, Rudolph! You really did! Uh, I think my jaw is broken! Don't worry, son. I know first aid. They taught us it when we watched Lethal Weapon continuously in the stables. Rudolph's father snaps his jaw into place. Ow! Oh, that's better! Oh! Hey! Hey, I think you fixed something, Dad. Yeah, you don't sound like a bitch. I don't. Well, kind of, but not as much. Like a 50... All right. Ho, ho, ho. Suddenly, a figure appears on the corner of the screen. Oh, Santa Claus. Santa Claus, wrapped in BDSM and carrying several whips, emerges. Santa Claus? Oh, shit. Oh, he's finally come for me. Rudolph, I see you've defeated the abominable snowman. Yeah, I did. And I didn't have any help either. Whoa, whoa, kid, slow down here. Well, if you didn't have any help, I'm going to have to take back my elf slave and whip him some. Oh, oh, no. Hermie helped. I, oh. He helped me out. He helped me out all the way back five years ago. Please, Santa. Yeah, I know Hermie quit and shouldn't have done that, but he's a good elf. Okay. And he tried to help people. Thank God. Jesus, thank you, kid. Holy fuck. Ho, oh, ho, oh, all right then, Rudolph. <sighs> I've been searching for your parents for a whole month. Thank you for saving them. You know, your father's a very good salesman. 
He, he is? Yes, he's number one operator on our phones. Wow. Yes. I didn't know you had a phone system. It's a secret. Hmm. Yes. Just like the whipping. Well. Yes. The North Pole's weird. There it is. Ho, oh, ho, ho. Uh, Santa brings the trio, which is more than a trio now, but a frio, a five of them, right? Fr a frio? Frida? Six? What? Santa Claus brings everyone back to the North Pole. <laughs> the six of them? By the way, uh, uh, Santa Claus, uh, do you want to be Santa now? Yeah, you're, you're Santa now. Yeah! Santa Claus, uh, look, we struck up a deal, uh, we were refugees for a while, and we struck up a deal, uh... Uh, King Moonracer, do you know of him? Ah, the one who lo uh, lives on the island of Misfit Toys. Ho, 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 yes, I know him. Yeah, okay, uh, look, we kind of broke the deal that uh, for us living there, you would deliver Misfit Toys. I, I mean, we could just kind of fuck him over and never go back, but uh, we kind of had a deal, so uh, it's possible you could drop some, I don't know, I don't know knife uh, toys or some I shit. would love to do some know, nice... Like, Drop it in, like, I don't fucking know, it's the poor neighborhoods, you know, no one will fucking know about that. Mm. Right? Yeah, I can yeah, do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, okay. See. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! And that's the story of how Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer was accepted by his <laughs> community. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, he's a little bitch no more. Oh. Because the abominable snow monster head is splattered all over the floor. I'll kill you! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. That was fun. Yay! So, uh, thank you, everyone, for listening to the uh, Matt and Al uh, Christmas, Christmas extravaganza. Special. Yes. The new background of my phone. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, thank you, everyone, who drew some fan art. Yes. It's beautiful stuff. Um, next week, uh, it'll be before, sorry, Bert, before yeah, New Year's. you should be sorry. <laughs> it'll be before New Year's, so we'll have a New Year's, oh my god, hiccups, New Year's, uh... A New Year's fiasco. Like, yeah, yeah, New Year's fiasco, where we'll go over probably nothing, so I don't think anyone has we'll any, We'll probably uh, get real drunk. Real drunk. Real drunk. We could do that. And guns. Firearms. Oh my fire god. Arms. I'm going to tell you about this new gun that okay. I got. Ooh, nice. I didn't get one, Al, because if I need a gun, uh -huh. I don't want to be there. 